Hey YouTube, this is Kate with your closet case. I know I haven't uploaded in a while and I want to apologize about that, for that, whatever. Um, life gets crazy sometimes and I don't know, but I'm back. And that's all that matters, right? PDA at homophobic school. I don't really have a lot of good advice about this because I, when I went to a homophobic school, I wasn't out. I actually didn't even know that I liked girls at the time. I hadn't admitted it to myself yet. But um, uh, what I do suggest is that uh, you don't do this. Something tells me that wouldn't have gone down well at a homophobic school. I I think an important thing in homophobic schools is to get the point across that you're not going to alter yourself for them. So even though I suggest, you know, no really, really intense PDA, I don't think you should stop holding hands if that's what you want to do or you know a sh little kiss in between periods or something um but if you're gonna show affection like that and it is a homophobic school and you think you're gonna get alienated for that you need to have a support group some sort of support system uh, whether it be some best friends or a teacher or GSA or something like that, um, guidance counselor, I don't know, but just make sure you have that support so that if you do get alienated, there's still someone there for you. Safety is by far the most important thing, so if you think that what you're doing is putting you in an unsafe situation, um, even if you believe you should be able to do that, whatever, if it's unsafe, don't do it. <laughs> wait for a better time, a better place. Um, wait until it's safe. Because above all, safety comes first. So yeah, that's about all the advice I think I'm qualified to give on this topic. Uh, hold hands, whatever. Hug, kiss. Do what you want to do. Make sure you're not alone. Eventually, one can hope, people will get used to seeing you and your girlfriend or boyfriend uh, together. That's about it. I'm sorry, this probably wasn't helpful, and I probably reiterated what like a bunch of people said before me, but that's fine. Uh... See you next week. She just looked up at me and said.